to the windows, to the walls, as the sweat drips down my cannonballs. Uh, all these bitches crawl. What is going on again, Nerd Paraders? Thank you guys so much for coming back to hang out with us today. We're playing some more Atlas, and we're being as manscaped as we can be because we just got our beard shaved and our hair cut and it oh so nicely dyed in the last episode. I hate it. I want my fluffy man beard back, but we're going to have to fix that at some point, sooner or later. Welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for coming to hang. I am Nick. This is Nerd Parade. Without further ado, we're going to kick off something that I'm really excited to bring you, and that's working on our crazy epic castle or pirate fortress build. Now, in the last episode, we talked a lot about doing that on this desert island, and we've kind of laid out the groundwork, and it is going to be humongous. Oh, if there was only a time that I had a nickel for every time I heard that phrase, I would have no nickels. Anyway, we've laid out the groundwork, like I've said, and I'm excited to show it off to you. Before this alpha steak eats my ass, blah, 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 holy crap, look at that. Oh, run. Run for the alpha steak. Is he, is he right? Oh, he's right there. The build is really cool. As you can see, we've got a couple of tricks that we've utilized to make it look like this. And I'm going to show you some of those building tricks here today. Uh, apparently, there's an alpha snake in our base and it scares me. I've got some structures on me. I think I've got more or less all that I need. I just want to outpace it. But we've got four major cylindrical bits. This guy's going to chase me for the entire episode. <laughs> we've got four major cylindrical builds here on each of the corner of our castle. I love the fact that we can do this kind of stuff with the triangle foundations, etc. And we've utilized some of our fancy door frames to make windows for our piratey fortress and castle. Anyway, once again, welcome to the channel, guys. Thank you so much for coming to hang. We're going to do some of this building together. We... This looks way more impressive than it actually is. So, have I outpaced this guy? I think I have. What we've done is we've utilized a lot of tactics like this. So, you see this entire base. It looks enormous. They're like, how did you put so many foundations down like that? Well, we didn't. All we did was we put down wall, like foundation walls to give it an elevation look so that it matches evenly with not only the terrain, but as far out as we've built here into the sea, into the ocean, into the gulf, rather, which we're going to try to protect very well with mortars and such. So on the map, if we take a quick look at it, you'll notice that it's very bright. There, we darkened it up a little bit. You'll see that there's shallow areas all around. We're in the center. We're in the dead center of this island. So there's shallow, shallow areas all around the entrance to where you could potentially sail a ship in. But if it's a galleon or such, it might have some difficulties getting in there. There are There is some deeper water there in the center. So we're going to protect basically this front side is what I'm going to refer to as the front facing this water with a ton of mortars so that we can protect against potential galleon invasion. However, before we get into that, I'm going to show you some of the tricks that we've used. Now... The walls, foundation walls that we have here function exactly like these. We've stacked the foundations, but we've done something like this. Now, we built a two wide, probably about every five or six-ish, uh, maybe even a little bit more foundation spaces to allow us to continue to do something of this nature. It gives us foundation support, even though there's not really uh, foundation support on there. So I'm going to build off of this and show you guys how we did it. This is all stone ceilings. Because it's kind of like a mirrored thing. So we got the base started, and now we can actually work on the structure itself. That part, the reason why we didn't do any of it on camera, because it was tedious, annoying, and it took for freaking ever. Because you have to go and you have to put the foundations, stack them up high enough so that they're even on both sides. In this case, I think it was like five. Uh, one, two, three, four. But yes, exactly five. So that we could have it even all the way through. A couple of extra on this end. I think that one got, some of them got to like six. But then underneath it placed the one layer of foundations and then the ceilings on top to make it work. So we're going to get into the building of it today. And we're, what we're going to do, so we have triangle ceilings. What we're going to do is make this entire thing covered like, doop -doop -boop 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 -boop. dramatic pause as we go over to the other side. We're going to make that look like this and I'm going to show you how we did it. And by this, I mean, bah, covered, beautifully covered. These other three are beautifully covered. 
and we saved the best one for the video. So like I was saying, most of this stuff was really, really tedious. I didn't want to sit there and be like, oh, look at what we're doing over and over and over again. We saved the best one for the last one. And we're also going to do some of the windows, how we did on there. So we're starting our epic castle, castle build. There is no such thing as overkill in the Nerd Parade vocabulary. So we always go big. And we always try to outbuild ourselves. And we have made a crazy pirate castle, or the start of one, for our future pirate endeavors. There's plenty of room for tames, plenty of room for activities. And we're going to start our, our building here. So... Triangle ceilings. What we've done is four and nine. It's the same as these foundations down here. Four square foundations and then nine triangles snapped each other to form a curve to make it perfectly perfectly cylindrical and or perfectly round. And what we're going to do is close in the, the ceilings. So ceilings and foundations would be the same. You're just, once you're placing the ceilings, you need to alternate them. So what I mean by alternate them, and I'm going to need to get more, is we have stone square ceiling here, right? So every time there's a stone square, we're going to want to place a triangle there. Rhyming is on point, not there. So this is triangle ceiling. We'd want to switch it back. Boop. So you flip-flop back and forth. You ping-pong back and forth to get this all closed in like such. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to switch mine. I have, what, 14 left? I'm going to switch mine, and I'm going to do only the triangles first. We're going to need to get more. So we're skipping this. This would be boop, 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 boop. And then we have square again. I'm going to run out. Oh, 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 it was perfect. No, it wasn't. I need, I think I need one more. No, 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 it was good. It was good. We got to go get more. So you want to ping pong yourself back and forth. So if there was a triangle, there was now a square. If there was a square, there was, damn, the snake. There was now a triangle. I got to go around because of the snake. You know what? Let me go over this side. I gotta outsmart this dude. I gotta use my pirate wits and ingenuity to outsmart that sneaky snake. Aha! Uh -huh. I didn't take any damage either. Yes! And we can also give you an idea of what it looks like from the outside. Now, like I was saying, we're trying to make this thing absolutely massive. We're gonna make it... I don't know if we're gonna make it tiered so it's like Mario-style castle, where it's like out, and then it goes in, and up, and in, and up. Like that kind of style castle. Or we're gonna do something a little bit weird, but the goal is... Go big or go home. The goal is to make these spires near Skybox. Near Skybox. I don't know if it's going to actually happen that way, but we're going to try to aim for it. One of the biggest builds that we've undertaken so far in Atlas, and I'm really excited to mess with it. Okay, let's see what we got here. Are these some of our ceilings? Yes, it is. I'll take 100 because I am completely naked, ready to go for this. We're specced into all of our weights. Oh, the stairs. I forgot to show off the stairs. This was something really cool. Now, I didn't have a hand in this. I didn't have a hand in the stairs. But we shit snacks and patty wax. The snakes are everywhere. Oh, why are these mother effing snakes in my mother effing castle? Oh, or I could just freak out through the whatever. So, the stairs, we're going to take a look at really quickly. We're not designed by me, but I wanted to have some kind of, like, grand epic staircase for the entrance to our castle and mine really took it upon himself to put this together and i'm very fond of what he did same kind of strategy as the rest of the thing so one layer of foundation stacked too high one layer then ceilings across it's a pretty standard build method uh it used to be very popular in arc survival evolved it still works in atlas and we've used it in the past since arc we're reusing it here in atlas so if you're new to these type, this type of genre of game, this company's game, then this type of building may help you. If not, it's just kind of a showcase of our amazing castle and how we're getting started with it. Did I outpace the snakes? Okay. So we apparently have a snake infestation, and at some point we're going to have to call the exterminator. But today is not that day. Do we have triangle ceilings? So that means one, two, three, and four. Let's swap it. You know what? I'm going to do the squares first. It's way easier just to do all the squares at once. Shit, shit, shit. There we go. Way, way easier, and then swap back and do your triangles. Because you don't have to switch. You don't have to ping-pong yourself back and forth. It's kind of a pain in the butt to do it. So we're going to try to seal this guy off completely. All right, and these should be triangles as well. Yes. Okay, see how it like kind of gets smaller and smaller as it goes in? You'll see. we got our triangles here. This one should be triangle ceiling, so that needs to be square. I was almost done. Okay, so now we've got to do our triangles. It goes way faster if you have two people. One doing squares, one doing triangles. 
and it actually works out really, 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 really nice. Okay, this is a square, so we're gonna do here. Boop, 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 boop. If you boop, it makes it that much cooler. We got triangle ceiling, I'll skip it. We got square ceiling. Okay, this should have been triangle. I skipped it earlier. Okay, this should be square, so we're doing triangles. If you mess up, if you like kind of lose track of what I'm doing here, just always look at the, it's the opposite of the one right before it. If you're trying to build a ceiling sort of like this, like how we're doing it. So this is a square ceiling. Next, we'll put triangle. Then we're going to want to put a square ceiling on the other side. So this should be square ceiling. This should be square ceiling. So we're doing triangles again. So in case you kind of like lose your place along the way, I lose my place all the time when I'm building, that helps me know what I'm doing. Okay, so this should be squares and we're doing triangles again. I'm a little ahead of myself on one side as opposed to the other side, but it's all right. <laughs> like here, I'm way more advanced than I am on that side. We'll meet in the middle though. It'll be all right. Oh, that was one too many. Pick you up. Okay, we got a triangle and let's go back. It is intensive on the resources. It would be even more intensive if we actually had foundationed up everything else, but we've done what we can. As you can see, I've probably almost gone through a hundred ceilings right there. Go big or go home. No such thing as overkill in our parade vocabulary. Let's swap that over to uh, square. It needed to be square all along. Boop, and I got three left. Sehu. So, we'll do you, you, and you. Time to dodge some snakes. Yes, time to dodge some, dodge some snakes because I have no more ceilings in my inventory. If I walk quietly, maybe they won't notice. I'm using all of my piratey skills to mask my presence. I'm the sneakiest butt wiggling man you've ever seen. All right, no, we're gonna we're gonna run this. Just just don't look at him. Don't look at him. Just look at the wall. Blair Witch it. Ooh, Blair Witching is working. I did not expect Blair Witching to actually work, but it did. It worked out in our favor. This is good. I've got a climbing pick just in case. And we're going to go back and get some more ceilings uh, and continue our build. Because I want to knock this out. I want to knock this out and I want to show you some of the windows, some of the walls. As the sweat drips down my ball. Hey, whoa! Cannonballs! As the sweat drips down my cannonballs! That's how we rap. I'm rapping on uh, on video now. Ooh, shit. Snacks, patty, wax. Gotta get over Okay. Gotta get over here. I'm actually pretty proud of that one. <laughs> to the windows, to the walls, as the sweat drips down my cannonballs, <laughs> all these bitches crawl. Uh, yeah, that's that's how we're gonna. That's our pirate rat for the day. Oh nope, get me up there. Aha! I'm the best pirate you've never heard of. Okay, go back into firsties. This should be triangles. They are. And this should be triangles, and they are one, two, three, triangles. A one, a two, a three. How many ceilings does it take to get to the center of a nerd parade base? Let's find out. Triangles or squares, squares. Let's catch this side up. Triangles and squares, triangles and squares. I know my shapes like triangles and squares. And that's gonna be triangular. Jackie de Plank was killed by- <gasps> That's what she gets for sleeping outside on the job. That's what Jackie DePlank gets. Square ceiling, so that's going to go triangle. This is going to go triangle. And we'll do you in the triangle. Triangular of form. I kind of messed that. I don't like the way that placed. I want to snap like that. Not that it really matters. I think it's just going to make the... Uh... Eh, that's fine. It wouldn't matter at all. We're going to seal that vulture in there. He's going to be our prisoner. Ha ha ha. Just give me uh, like five solid minutes, vulture. And we're going to trap you down there as we place every ceiling that we've got. Oh no! He's escaped! He's an escape artist! <laughs> oh yeah, it is snapping the, it's snapping the weird way. It's going to make the uh, the stones face a different un-OCD friendly way. And we can't have that. It's got to be as OCD friendly as possible. And that's why we build the way that we build. It's got to look beautiful. Just because we're pirates doesn't mean we can make ugly structures. We have to make beautiful structures. We're pretty pirates, as you can tell from my haircut. We're the prettiest pirates that ever sailed through these seas. Almost done. It's an intense process, building an atlas. Building in general is usually an intense process. I didn't need to put that away. We're almost there. 
<laughs> oh, I'm so excited for the completed product. Oh, shit. I messed up my keys. 14, gotta get more ceilings. Don't mess with me, Vulture. Coming to my home. Uh, triangle ceilings, that needs to be square. We're gonna have to go get more. So many. So many ceilings. There we go. Dodge of Cobras, getting more ceilings. Woo! Back in the water. It's complete. And we'll use our climbing hooks. We're playing it safe. We don't want to mess with these dudes. We don't have any more piratey raps to sing for you on our way back. So we're just going to have to make it, uh... We're going to make something else up. Like, hey! Look at my ass and junk. <laughs> Nerd parady distractions! We're not buying time as we run back to get more structures at all. You know what? I might be able to carry... Uh, I'm pretty sure I can carry more than 100. I'm actually just plebbing it. I could probably carry like 200 at a time. I can. I'm going to be able... Slightly fatter. Oh god, I'm slightly fatter. I can't outrun the cobra. That's why I was carrying only a hundred at a time. Epic b-hole clinch is epic. He's not behind me. Oh, my mustache is scared. Mustache time, mustache time. I hope you like my mustache rhyme. Mustache time, mustache time. I hope you like my mustache rhyme. Let's go build some stuff. Ah, oh, that's fun. That's what we're just going to do. We're going to sing. We're going to do a little dance. We're going to make a little love. Uh, pretty much just get down tonight as we start to build our castle. But as you can see, this is a huge undertaking. This is not something that's going to be completed overnight. This is insanity. And you can probably see why... Oh, no, no, no! No, you got too many times. What? Am I too fat to make this? There we go. I wasn't too fat. It just took three times. As you can see, this is why we didn't want to do, like, all the foundation placing on cam, because it could be kind of boring. There's on only so many rhymes I can make up at one time. It would have eventually been like, and here we're placed, like, Bill Nye. Like, and he not Bill Nye, Bill Stein. There we go, the for dry, red eyes, that guy. Now we're placing some more foundations. No, Bill Nye is the cool science guy. Bill Stein is the monotone guy. <laughs> I'm mixing up my bills! See, see what building does to me? Makes me mess up my bills. I'm sorry. I apologize to all bills everywhere. I'll try to get you straight. Even my dollar bills. <laughs> I'm fucking hilarious. Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit, it's 11. We're almost done here. I've got way too many ceilings at this point. I really didn't need this many. But, no such thing as overkill in the Nerd Parade vocabulary. T. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Uh-huh. Yep. Mm -hmm. Almost there. The most satisfying part is when it's actually finished. Because then you're like, oh, it's gorgeous. Okay, so that's going to need to be a... That, that's going to be a square. Mm -hmm. That's going to be... Mm -hmm. And uh-huh. And then there. And then there. Okay, so let's do this. This is when, this is the, when it's all coming together. Get ready. Prepare yourself. It's a satisfying feeling. Look at how nice. Look at how nice. Isn't that like a really satisfying feeling, just watching it all come together? For me, I find it extremely satisfying. So now, we're going to do some of the windows on the walls. Okay, snakes stay away from my balls. So, we've done a wall on every other, as you can see. So, we're kind of mirroring that. We've taken door frames and we've made them into windows for colossal castle proportion. Can people get through them? Yes. But it's going to be funny when they do, because we're going to have all types of pirated traps in this pirate base. We've got many things, many ideas, many ridiculous shenanigans planned. So, wall, swapping to frame, too high. Behold, a beautiful window. We can go back to wall. Uh, back to wall. Uh-huh. 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 Boom! Oh, shit's next! I messed that up. I really didn't mean to do that. That was... There. That's what that's supposed to look like. Beautiful castle-like window! Can we climb through it? Yes, we can. It's gonna be kind of crazy, because I bet people will. Let me through there. <laughs> it's gonna be neat! It's gonna be really neat. I, I'm excited to see people attack the piratey fortress. I'm very excited for it. I'm also very excited to build some crazy defenses on the Piratey Fortress. But this is just an undertaking. This is going to take a while for us to build. This is a very big project that we've kind of taken on. And I'm excited to do what we can. 
He spotted me, didn't he? Okay, we're okay. I'm very excited to take this sucker on. I've rambled on for quite a bit here, but lastly and leastly, I want to make sure that I show everything off to you. I... We've covered the little towers. We've covered the staircase. Once we get more, we've got a little... This, this little structure in the center is mine's structure. Should I, should I mess with him? No, I'm actually not. Mine built himself literally inside of this to not get killed by the snakes. Rambo got killed by the snakes. He, he did not build himself within a structure. Me? I just went to sleep on top of mine's structure last night. I had the high ground, Anakin. I took care of myself. I outsmarted the snakes with a higher advantage. There's not really too terribly much to show off, though, at this stage. It's a lot of repetitive nature, a lot of ding, 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 and we've gone four high. These are the normal type of, uh, type of gateways that we made for doors. We're going to have to get doors on them, but these are just the frames to give you kind of a reference. That was frame of reference, and I just shortened that shit. I scooched it together, pissed off the cobra. Because there's far too much time wasted by saying two words, I had to combine them to save all the time that I could possibly save. And we've made it that way so that we can get dinosaurs, our zoo, our pirate zoo, in and out of our castle if we need to. Ha ha ha, rhyming so on point. God, snakes everywhere. This island is infested. But like I said, I've rambled on long enough, guys. I hope you actually enjoyed a little bit of the castle build. I'm excited to bring it to you here today. I'm excited to show you the next undertaking that we have decided to, <laughs> well, attempt at least on the Nerd Prey channel. And as per usual, we go big or we go home. Thank you guys so much for coming to hang out with me today. I hope you enjoyed this one enough to drop a thumbs up on it for me. Let me know that you're excited for the castle build because I certainly am. There's going to be a lot to do and so little time to do it in. But our four spires, as well as our stairs are looking good so far. Thank you guys again so much for coming to join me while we played some Atlas and did a little building. If you haven't done so yet, please be sure to subscribe to the channel for some more cool videos just like this one. Or don't. Who the fuck cares? What do I know? But most importantly of all, I always want you to remember to take care of yourselves out there, guys. Stay awesome, and we'll catch you in the next piratey episode of Atlas. Later.